In this episode of Cloud Performance Atlas, we take a look at the read-write performance of our storage buckets. Will everything fit in the overhead compartments? Stay tuned to find out. Over the last few weeks, we've had a lot of interest from web developers regarding the performance of Google Cloud Storage, which is listed as a unified object storage solution in the cloud. Or in simpler terms, it's a place in the cloud to serve files. We've got some follow-up articles on exact questions they ask, but before we get to those, I wanted to establish a baseline of performance for reading and writing to GCS. For most web developers, read performance from GCS is uh, kind of a big deal. I mean, anytime you use it for static data, like webs or game files, you want that as fast as possible. To test this, we place an asset in a region bucket in US Central, and then fetch that asset from a bunch of machines located around the world. Uh, now, because this bucket is regional, the graph shows that the farther away the request, the higher the latency due to, you know, physics. Turning on caching or using a multi-regional bucket should easily fix this, but we'll talk about that in a different video. Just stay tuned. Of course, on the other side of the coin is write performance. If you've got a lot of users uploading images from their 3G devices straight into GCS, then write performance is probably a big deal for you. To test this, let's just upload the same file under different names to the US Central 1 bucket from various places in the world. Uh, again, the graph shows that the farther away uploads take a little longer time, but it's within expectations given the size of the file. Now, direct read-write performance is easy to test, but in honesty, there's lots of variables here that influence performance, which make it a pain to write proper benchmarking for. Thankfully, you don't have to write all of those tests yourself. The gsutil perf diag command runs a suite of diagnostic tests for a given cloud storage bucket, giving information on latency and throughput tests for read, write, delete, download, metadata, and upload operations. So if you're ever in doubt about how your GCS bucket is performing, perf diag is a great first step. And if you're in doubt about the rest of your cloud performance, check out the associated article for this video linked in the description below. And don't forget to check out the rest of our Cloud Performance Atlas content, because when it comes to performance, every millisecond counts.